everyone welcome to her courage to plan my name is megan today's video guys we are closing out our last budget of the year yes december 2020 budget we are closing it out and basically guys this is it i do wish you guys a happy new year and prosperous year and beyond so many blessings to you guys this has been a interesting year to say the least it has not been all bad guys it has not even though there's been a lot going on in 2020 guys i can still see the blessings so again guys i thank you so much for your support you all have been truly awesome you all are just totally amazing so by chance if you missed the video of the december setup I will leave that link up above and you can go back and check it out. Now guys, if you're liking this spread, this is part of the December kit. Now they are now grab bags. So I still have a few grab bags left for the November and the December kits. So guys, if you are interested in any of the grab bags, I do encourage you to go ahead and snag your copy because it is limited supply and you get a host of different stickers. Um, you know your budget kits some of them are full kits guys and they are at raw bottom prices So I do have the link to my Etsy shop down below in the, the description box if you are interested All right guys, so closing out December. So for hubs We had planned for the whole month of December 2302 to be direct deposited into this account and 2302 was deposited now what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to take this out because I wanna make sure I'm not hitting up against these rings. All right guys, that is much better. So for me, $1,400 was deposited into this account. Now we did have the rollover of the $150 and also our son paid his phone bill. So I'm just gonna put on here plus S phone and that was an additional $35. So that total should have been 185. So 150 plus the 35, that's 185. And the total amount that we were working with in this account was the 185 plus the 1400 plus 2302, which is a total of 3887 into this joint household account. And then for tithe and offering, it actually came in, guys, at 617. We planned 680, but it came in a little lower. And then, of course, for our mortgage, that actual amount, 502. Our Netflix, 1599. Internet was 6372. YouTube, of course, was the same. Our electricity, which is our last month budget billing, and I talked about that in the last video um, of our uh, budget. So we will no longer be on budget billing. So that's the 290.86 that was paid for December. Our car insurance, the 250.98 was paid. And Hulu, guys, I talked about this in paycheck budget number two. Hulu has been canceled, so that was not paid. AT&T, $86.50 was paid. Life insurance came in at the same, $62.64. Our pest control, $55. Our lawn service at $100. And for our groceries, guys, our groceries for the month, guys, we actually planned $875. We came in at $790.30. 15 cents guys that is amazing and I've told you guys what I have started doing and that is meal planning even though I'm only meal planning three to four days a week guys you can see that just that change along with you know making sure that I'm using you know Ibotta rebates this here has made a difference in our grocery bill so I'm just super excited because I just want to continue trying to get that grocery bill lowered all right, so for our house supplies, our house supplies, the total for the month, $75. But guys, we end up spending $68.35 for the whole month. Gas, we didn't get any gas for this month. Like I said, I am on holiday slash vacation from the job. And Hubs is taking a few days here and there. But we haven't really been going anywhere other than the grocery store, um, maybe to 
you know, take some packages to the post office, and of course, church. And then our insurance membership, that was paid, the $35. And we didn't have to touch the buffer, guys. We didn't have to do that. So what I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna go ahead and total these expenditures so we can see where we're at. We have come in at 2333.16 for our expenditures, which is awesome sauce. We had planned 2572, so we are already below. That is just amazing, guys. That is just amazing. Now, let's go ahead on our continued sheet because we do our budget on two pages. So our household emergency fund, the actual amount was $50. Son's tuition got $150. Our vacation got the total $350. And then pets got their $50. And of course taxes, we are not putting in the um, tax fund just yet. And guys, we still have not gotten any notification from the IRS about our you know, um, taxes being processed. So we will you know, move forward with putting the money into that savings category until we have a actual account where we can put the monies on as far as debt. So the actual amounts total was the $600 for savings. So now I can go ahead and crunch these numbers guys for the month of December. So down here for actual, the actual income is $38.87. And then for our giving came in at 617. Our expenses came in at the 2333.16. Our savings at 600. And we can crunch the numbers and see what we have left for the month of December. So we take the 3887 minus 617 minus 2333.16 minus 600. Guys, we have $336.84 left in our budget. That is amazing, guys. That is just awesome sauce. We are ending December with a bang. So that money, guys, it'll just sit in our account because we are closing out for December. We've closed out our budget. We're not necessarily zeroing out this budget. Um, last December, we didn't zero it out. We didn't roll anything over. We starting fresh in 2021 as far as January budget. So this is awesome sauce. But as a quick recap, I can just kind of look and see um, our tithe and offering that came in lower than expected. Of course, we did not have to pay the Hulu. You can see that's zero. And trying to see here, of course, we made awesome strides with our groceries, guys. Our groceries came in really nicely. They came in really almost what? Almost $100. So that's awesome. Our house supplies, we were below there, and we didn't use any of the gas, so we allocated $100 for gas, so we haven't even used our gas. And um, we didn't use the buffer, even though it was a small buffer. All of those savings add up, guys. So I am satisfied. This is awesome, guys. We are closing out on a positive note, and I'm just excited, guys. Let's have a conversation. Leave me a comment down below. If you've already completed your monthly budget closeout, how's it looking, guys? Are you closing out on a positive note and starting fresh for January? Either way, we're starting fresh, guys. But leave me a comment down below. How did your December monthly budget go? All right, guys. I want to wish you all a happy new year again. Many blessings to you guys. I'm wishing you a happy and prosperous year and beyond. Guys, I am being optimistic. I'm going to continue to keep you all in prayer. Just continue to keep us in prayer, guys. So with that said, guys, I'm going to see you later.
Bye.